The deputy head of the European Parliament's Industry, Research and Energy Committee warned Britain that the European Commission's chief Brexit negotiator Michel Barnier didn't even care about the divorce bill, despite Brussels' enormous demands for the UK's cash. The Prime Minister eventually settled an agreement to move on to the next phase of Brexit talks in early December. Mrs May, alongside the government's divorce negotiators, signed the first phase deal on the Northern Ireland border, the divorce bill and EU citizens' rights. The deal was seen by many Brexiteers as a defeat because of the concessions offered by the UK government to Brussels in order to progress. Express Getty Brexit News. Hans Olaf Henkel says Michel Barnier is out to make it hard for UK. I think they wanted to make the negotiations very difficult, and they've reached their objective. Hans Olaf Henkel Conservative MP Jacob Rees-Mogg warned failure to ditch EU law would make the UK a vassal state after it was suggested the European Court of Justice will play a role in the country during a proposed transitional phase. And Mr Henkel predicts that Brussels will still continue to make it difficult for the UK in future discussions as Mr Barnier seeks to protect the European Union from further departures. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk, Mr Henkel said, I don't think the money is really the issue. I think they wanted to make the negotiations very difficult, and they've reached their objective. Now, six months are over and we still have not talked about trade, which is the most important subject they wanted to demonstrate to the rest of the European Union that leaving the European Union is difficult, so to make sure no one else gets the same idea, Mrs May is now plotting to strike a bespoke deal with the EU, despite Mr Barnier insisting such an agreement would be impossible to reach. Ministers say the deal is designed to avoid a Swiss trap, so-called because Switzerland's EU agreement means a change in one sector could lead to the entire deal unravelling, a Whitehall source told the Times. The last thing we want is to strike a deal that then has to be renegotiated a few years down the line. Friday, December 8, 2017 Here is the 15-page Brexit deal in full other sectors would not be included in the deal, leaving the government to enforce whatever regulations it sees fit. Although some in Brussels are keen for a sector-by-sector -sector deal, they are likely to demand certain areas, most Notably the City of London will have to abide by existing rules. The approach could cause further cabinet rifts, with Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson hoping to rid Britain of all of Brussels' red tape. Mr Johnson is leading a group of senior ministers who want slash EU regulation, but Chancellor Philip Hammond is hoping to keep elements of Brussels' rule to ensure single market access.